my name is Jolene Fisher, and I'm a graduate from the dance theater program at AMDA. After graduation, I started doing the Waterworld show in Hollywood. So my name is Helen in the show, and she saves the world in the post-apocalyptic era, and it's about a 17-minute live-action stunt show. You're riding jet skis, boats, fighting, climbing up ladders. After doing the show for two years in Hollywood, the company asked me if I wanted to transfer to Japan, and I was like, yes. So fast forward to where I am now. I'm currently living in Japan doing this show. We actually did about three weeks of learning the show in Japanese. First of all, the basic Japanese, and then transitioning into the show. The music avenue for me personally, I was fortunate to be surrounded by some really incredible music people in the industry. You'd be so angry if you only knew I'd rather be an outcast. I ended up meeting Igor Koroshev, who used to play keyboard in Yes. And Igor Koroshev and I actually got together and we wrote Outcast and released it last August. So that was the first one of many more to come. So the dance theater program at AMDA, it's hard. I feel like when you first come to AMDA, you go into it thinking, I'm going to be a dancer. I'm going to study dance and that's it. And then you get here and it's like, psych, welcome to your musical theater class. Welcome to your dance for camera class. And you're like, oh, there's a lot more things that I need to learn. So my attitude towards post AMDA life was, I think I was excited to step out and get into the real world and start going to the auditions that you hear about. That was kind of exciting because I, I guess it was only really like two or three months out of college and I had got my first dance gig. So I was like, hmm, okay, this is gonna be fun. I love doing what I do because every time you go on a stage there's no feeling like being able to transition into that character for the next 17 minutes, I'm not myself, is such a cool thing to be able to do. It definitely makes me feel alive every time I'm on stage, and I don't want to do anything else. <laughs>